Ali Abbasi's new film, The Apprentice, takes a bold and introspective look at Donald Trump's formative years in the real estate world, coinciding with his ongoing quest for another presidential term. Released in theaters on October 11th, the film delves into the complexities of Trump's character, his relationships, and the often murky waters of his moral landscape. Abbasi, an Iranian-born director now residing in Denmark, brings a unique perspective to this exploration, having previously tackled themes of the supernatural and horror. The film's narrative presents a radically humanist angle, focusing on Trump's journey under the mentorship of the controversial lawyer Roy Cohn, played by Jeremy Strong. In this depiction, Trump, portrayed by Sebastian Stan, appears as a young man striving for approval from his father and grappling with the challenges of a competitive real estate market. The film highlights the dynamics between Trump and Cohn, who is not just a mentor but also a figure shrouded in contradiction, a closeted gay man with a penchant for anti-intellectualism. Abbasi's approach paints a picture of Cohn that reveals both his charm and his complexities, inviting audiences to consider the intricate tapestry of American populism and the media's role in shaping reality. While The Apprentice offers an empathetic look at Cohn's final days, it simultaneously portrays Trump's relationships with his family, particularly his brother Fred and first wife Ivana, played by Maria Bakalova. The film immerses viewers in the gritty and vibrant backdrop of New York City during the 1970s and 1980s, depicted through grainy documentary-style cinematography that captures the essence of the era. However, the film has not been without controversy. It includes sensitive scenes, such as an alleged instance of Trump raping Ivana, based on claims she made during their divorce proceedings, which she later walked back. This aspect of the film has ignited legal threats from Trump's team, who attempted to thwart its distribution, claiming the portrayal was defamatory. Abbasi recounts how the film faced significant hurdles in securing financing, with some in Hollywood deeming it too sympathetic to Trump. Despite the controversies, Abbasi asserts that the film is based on verifiable events and presents a narrative that invites viewers to examine the structure of power in American politics, rather than simply focusing on the polarizing figures within it. He challenges the audience to see Trump not as a monster but as a product of the political system, blurring the lines between right and wrong. Abbasi suggests that understanding this complexity is essential to grasping the dynamics at play in contemporary American society. Ultimately, the Apprentice serves as a lens through which to scrutinize the rise of Trump, illustrating the intricacies of his character and the societal forces that have shaped him. It invites audiences to engage in a deeper conversation about the nature of power, identity, and the narratives we construct about our leaders. As the film unfolds, viewers are prompted to reflect on their perceptions of Trump and the political landscape that continues to evolve in his shadow. Stay subscribed for more videos.